Versus Saxton and Hale is a game mode in TF2 which was added in a summer update. It's extremely fun and has you bullying a homeless, shirtless Australian man who's extremely tanky and can murder you in one punch. I've spent a lot of time on this mod, before and after the update. The new version of the mode has pretty different balance in its classes and which ones are better and worse. For example, Pyro was really bad in the original, mainly because of the Rager mechanic. In the V-Script version, he's pretty good due to the lack of it. Other classes, like Medic, kept their place as the best of the best, but there were some classes that got way worse. And the main case this is sadly Soldier. Soldier is a jack at all trades. He can fulfill many roles. In the original versus Saxon Hale, he was probably one of the best classes available. He could easily get crit rockets by just taunting. His mobility with the Liberty Launcher was amazing, and it dealt zero damage to him. And the Market Gardener could deal upwards of 1000 damage to Hale. He was amazing in general. Then the V-Script version came along and just sorta killed Soldier. He has options, but nearly all of them are replaced by just playing other classes. His damage output with the rocket launchers is just mediocre at best. I'll try and talk about all of them, but I feel like I'll probably skip over a few. This stock is a decent choice, but I feel it's outclassed. The cow mangler sounds good, infinite ammo and an alt fire, but it's honestly just okay. The alt fire almost always misses due to Hale's mobility, and the lack of crits just kinda sucks. The infinite ammo is very useful, however. The direct hit seems alright, but I suck at using it. The mini crits on Hale is a very useful trait, but he jumps around a lot. The rocket jumper is good, but the nerf to it with the ammo reduction is very sad. The airstrike is probably the, one of the best options for this mod. It deals great damage to Hale, and I just love using it. I guess the downside is the fact that you're losing tons of health rocket jumping. The best rocket launcher available, at least in my opinion, is the black box. The health on hit is very useful as it soldier benefits greatly from it, as he can tank two hits from hail. The clip penalty is still pretty annoying, like in casual. Would you be surprised if I told you that in this mode you don't want to be using the rocket launchers as much as you want to be using the melee weapon slot? Rocket jumping can certainly get you out of Hale's range, but Hale moves around so much in the air that you don't get much chances hitting him with the splash damage. Really quickly, I just want to mention the reserve shooter and the fact that I really like it in its mode. If Hale is in the air at all, it deals crits. I used it on Soldier for a bit and it's honestly not too bad. Damage falloff does kill it though. If you're already at max ramp up range, there's much better things you could be doing. So Soldier with all this information seems pretty hopeless, right? Well, he has two more tricks up his sleeve, and both of them revolve around his melee weapons. First, let's cover Soldier Knight. Soldier Knight is a strategy where you pair the half Satoichi in the battalion's backup, and you just hit Saxton as much as you can, and activate the backup when available. This strategy is really fun and addicting, you can get massive damage against Hale and the Zatoichi does pretty good knockback, so Hale can't do much against the soldier doing this. It's effective in small cramped areas. I really love this strat, but there are a few issues. You don't have much mobility, but unless you want to rocket jump, you have to damage yourself and you don't want to do that as a soldier knight. You die in two punches unless you have a banner up, also if you miss a hit, you're basically dead. The other issue with Soldier Knight is, uh, Demo Knight just exists? Like, Demo Knight can survive a fully charged Saxon punch and survive another normal punch with the Eye Lander, and he's just faster than Soldier anyway, so you're probably just better off playing him. Also, Hit Reg. Do I need to say any more? So, Soldier seems truly pointless now, right? Well, not quite yet. There's one more trick Soldier has up his sleeve. Soldier is the soldier's saving grace, as it saves him from being absolutely useless. Now he can be effective with his oversized spoon! If you don't know, the Market Gardener is a melee weapon which deals crits while rocket jumping. In Versus Saxon Hail, it deals the same amount of damage as a backstab. So basically, the Trollger playstyle is like 
a more fun spy. But is it more effective? Well, it's certainly harder to hit a garden. You don't get a get out of jail free card like the Dead Ringer for Spy. But Soldier's Mobility makes up for it as he can escape hail pretty easily. Also, it's just way more fun to hit hail with a big old shovel than just going behind them. You can get massive damage easily with this playstyle, and if you are struggling to hit your guardings, you can use the base jumper. It's not as fun as you did man treads personally, but it works. I obviously use the rocket jumper, but using the gunboats and a different rocket launcher could also work. So yeah, soldier can work if you only use your big shovel. There are, of course, problems with this playstyle. First of all, you basically only take one hit as fall damage exists. This isn't the case if you use the backup, but what's the point of that using the Latin Trilogy? Normal Soldier suffers from this problem way less. The other problem is that Market Gardens can be really hard. Of course if you practice you'll be great at them, but otherwise you're probably just going to be landing in front of hail and getting bitch slapped. But once you figure out the way of the Trilogy, anyone who gets chosen to play hail will dread you. So that's basically it. There are also the other banners and the other things about Soldier I haven't mentioned like the wall climbing. But oh well. No idea what the next video will be and I'm sorry about the lack of uploads. I've been being lazy recently so oopsie. Please join the discord server in the description and subscribe if you haven't. Have a nice day. Bye.